Hey, what's up beautiful people? It's Sindarama. Welcome to the channel. Today we have this very interesting video from going from the black conservative perspective. And I decided to Jada Pinkett Smith humiliates Will Smith again as she reveals that she ruined that he ruined his career for nothing. Hmm. Wow, it's no news Jada Smith and um Will Smith have been trending and um there's a lot of information on social media and I'm excited to hear what Greg of Gotta say regarding this topic let's check it out we only got married because gammy was crying <laughs> well gammy this is what happened <laughs> when I, it was almost as if gammy was like you have to get married so let's talk about the wedding it was almost like that and like and she completely just was like that's yeah, not a reality where you're I not was married under so much pressure you know being a young actress being yeah. young and, and i was just and like pregnant. pregnant i just i was just like i didn't know what to do but i just knew i was like i never wanted to be married i i don't remember that i remember feeling very strongly and and wanting you guys to be married i do remember that yes. but i don't remember your rejection of the idea of marriage say i'm a mean girl i'm gonna tell you what i am and that's a petty <laughs> okay i'm a petty <laughs> because here's the thing now i might not say some mean things and i might not do some mean things but if you do something to me yeah baby let me tell you i'm gonna hold on to it until yeah. the moment comes where you and it'll be like oh what what did you what you need? You need me? Oh, no. <laughs> what? A few years later. There are so many surprising things in the book, but the thing that surprised me the most, that I actually had to reread it because right. I said, is this true? Right. Was that in 2016, you and Will decided that you were going to live completely separate lives. Yes. It was not a divorce on paper. Right. But it was a divorce. divorce so from the year 2016 mm. which is seven years ago now <laughs> yes y'all have been apart yeah all right guys so wow. we have to talk about holly weird okay and the reason why we got to talk about holly weird <laughs> is because we have to follow up on a story that as a man in my opinion i just fail to understand the situation and this situation involves will and jada pickett smith okay now you guys are all familiar with the slap the oscar slap that was heard around the world yeah. in which will smith went on stage and slapped chris rock for disrespecting his wife you guys all remember that right oh. yeah jada i love you gi jane too can't wait to see it all right <laughs> That was a nice one. Okay. I'm out here. Uh oh, Richard. <laughs> Ow. Will Smith just smacked the shit out of me. Keep your wife's name out your mouth. Wow, dude. Yes. It was a G.I. Jane joke. Keep my wife's name out your mouth. I'm going to, okay? <laughs> I could, oh, okay. That was the uh, greatest night in the history of television. Okay. Okay. Now, again, this situation was one of the most talked about stories in the media, in the news, for yeah. probably at least a couple weeks, right? Because people were going back and forth, taking sides in the situation. Mm -hmm. Some people understood why Will Smith did it. He was defending his wife. And some people did it, right? Some people had questions as to why would Will Smith do this? Because uh, Jada Pickett Smith doesn't necessarily seem like a good wife. She seems like a very emotionally manipulative person. And there were all types of videos that leaked on the internet and in speculation regarding their relationship because it was well known that Jada Pickett Smith was in an entanglement with r b singer august a senior okay she was getting her cheeks clapped by another man and uh apparently i don't know will smith was okay with it okay uh and there's also been other humiliating videos that have come out on the internet regarding 
uh will and jada pickett smith's relationship that makes will smith really seem like a lost man take a look you know Esther perel is coming to the table she's going to be at the red table would you say she has been instrumental in you and i redefining our relationship i would say don't just start filming me without asking me oh my goodness if you could film Esther, me Esther, come help us again please I'm still dealing with foolishness. Don't. No, nah, no, nah, she, yeah, because she, don't just. Would you say that she helped us heal the hurts that we caused between one another? My social media presence is my bread and butter, okay? So you can't just use me for social media and not, you know, don't just start rolling. I'm standing in my house. Don't just start rolling. Don't Please just... watch a stare at the red table because she's helped us a lot. Can't you tell? Yeah, so you see that, you heard that, okay? Now, um, this is just, again, one of the few videos that is floating around on the internet of Jada Pickett Smith embarrassing Will Smith and leaving people scratching their heads wondering why in the world is this very powerful man? Why is he still with this woman who he ruined his career over? He went on stage at the Oscars and slapped a man on stage, Chris Rock, okay? Something that he still has not recovered from why is he still married to this woman okay well now we're gonna have even more questions because jada pickett smith is doing what jada pickett smith does which is being an agent of chaos and trying to draw attention for herself at the expense of her husband she's going to humiliate him even more in this new book that she's releasing called worthy in which you mm. can see her face on the cover of this book which by the way i mean guys is it just me or does Jada Pickett Smith head looked like an 05 PT cruiser, right? Like <laughs> the comparison, the the similar the similarities are uncanny here, right? Her, her head looks like an 05 PT I'm cruiser, bro. Nah, don't do this. I'm but offended. anyways, anyways, so in this new bombshell interview in which she's promoting her book again at the expense of her husband, okay? She's humiliating her husband for clout, okay? This seems to be her mo, right? Uh, she goes on to admit that her and her husband, Will Smith, have actually been separated. They've been separated for a long time now. Take a look. TV quite a bit. We have an image, a series of images. And when we first saw these images, we didn't really understand them. And now, nearly two years later, we still don't really understand them. What prompted Will Smith to get up from his seat at the Oscars? walk onto the stage and slap Chris Rock. And for those who were the very closest to the actual incident, as we're now learning, they didn't quite get it either. Jada Pinkett Smith has a brand new book out and a deeply coordinated PR blitz this morning with excerpts from the book and a new exclusive TV interview. And she shares her side of the slap story. And her side, she thought it was a skit too. I thought this is a skit. I was like, there's no way that Will hit him. It wasn't until Will started to walk back to his chair that I even realized it wasn't a skit. In her book, Jada writes, I'm unclear on the reason Will is so upset. Well, maybe the reason is the new revelation in the book. The couple, Will and Jada, in effect, have been separated. They've been separated for years. You and I decided we were gonna take our space and what happened. Yeah, and then I got into an entanglement with August, that's what I said. An entanglement? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, of course she had this entanglement and that made global headlines because as she details in this new book, the book is called Worthy. Will and Jada have been separated, have not been a romantic couple since 2016. Jada uh, with Hoda Kapti on the Today Show uh, earlier today. There are so many surprising things in the book, but the thing that surprised me the most, that I actually had to reread it right. because I said, is this true? Right. Was that in 2016, you and Will decided that you were going to live completely separate lives. Yes. It was not a divorce on paper, right. but it was a divorce. divorce. So from the year 2016, which is seven years ago now, <laughs> yes. y'all have been 
apart. Yeah. All right. Hoda then asked the question that anybody asked. Why not just divorce and call it quits? I made a promise that there will never be a reason for us to get a divorce. We will work through mm. whatever. And I just haven't been able to break that promise. Mm. But you still live separately. We live separately. All right. Huh. Um, is it a health insurance thing? <laughs> of course, all of it, well, you know, you know, all of it's coming up because guess what? Who's on the cover of People Magazine? Yeah. It's Jada Pinkett-Smith, yeah. ready to tell my side of the story. Uh, the book itself will come out next Tuesday, October 17th. Yeah, so you seen that, you heard that, okay? What you have there is something that, again, as a man, is very shocking, okay? Because it's one thing if... This is a woman that you're married to, you're living with, like she's actually your wife, okay? Yeah. And even though, you know, she's getting her cheeks clapped by other men, you know, functionally, you're trying to make the relationship work. work. However, apparently, according to Jada Pickett Smith, that's not the case. They've been separated, living two completely different lives, but I guess in the public's eyes, they've been pretending that they're married, that they have a real relationship. So if that is the case, why in the world would Will Smith ruin his career okay. going on stage at the Oscars in front of the world and smacking, assaulting Chris Rock for making a joke about a woman that he don't even sleep with every night? Yeah. He's not even living with her. They're not together. But he threw away his career and his livelihood for her, a woman that is still in love with Tupac. Right? That's in love with another man. The only reason she's with Will Smith is because Tupac died. And they're not even living together. They're not even in a relationship. She's getting her cheeks clapped by other men. But then again, you know, Will Smith may have slapped Chris Rock because allegedly Chris Rock oh had God. asked out Jada Pickett Smith amid rumors that she and Will were divorcing. Right? Apparently, Chris Rock asked to take her out. Okay? Asked to take her out. Now, mm. who knows? Maybe, just maybe, that's why Will Smith got so upset. Right? Maybe that's why he got so upset. Regardless, uh. he ruined his career over this woman. And she continues to humiliate him at the expense of his career. I mean, the whole Red Table Talk is basically a humiliation ritual of Will Smith. And she continues to humiliate him. She humiliated him after the slap because she basically came out and blamed him for it. So I don't know why he did it. I don't know why he thought he should defend me, right? And then she further humiliates the guy by revealing that, oh yeah, well, we haven't been together since 2016, 2017. We haven't been together for years. Wow, this is, it blows my mind. And I guess this kind of, you know, confirms some of the, the red pill talking points when it comes to the statistics about divorce, right? Where, you know, what we know of in regards to divorce statistics, um, that's just what we have on paper, right? That's just what goes through the legal system. <laughs> but effectively, there are probably a lot more cu cu uh, couples in this country that are still legally married, but yet, they don't really live together, okay? Which, again, is kind of a sad state of affairs, okay? That's what you kind of have going on here and is playing out in the public's eye. All I know is this. Will Smith, uh, at this point, he's become the definition of a simp, right? Because this, by definition, is the overvaluing of a mediocre woman i mean i don't know maybe the box is fire right but i don't care how fire the box is okay this ain't worth it right this ain't worth it. especially if you share in the box with other men right if you got to share the box it doesn't matter how fire it is that and again your career being destroyed but yet mm. you're going out of your way to defend this woman and to put yourself through all types of conflict and humiliation yeah. over this woman again i don't get it i don't understand it you know maybe it's for the children i'm not sure but again oh, 
with all this information now, it's no surprise that his kids have turned out so weird, right? His kids are weird. The whole family's weird, okay? Is this what happens when you get involved with Holly weird? You just become a weirdo? Because that's what this is. This, to me, seems to be just weirdness, right? <laughs> I, mean, I don't really know how else to describe it. But so it seems, you know, Will Smith is a, is a broken man. He really is. I don't understand why he's still legally married to the woman, allowing her to traffic off of his last name, traffic off of the fact that, hey, they're still legally married. Uh, I, I just think he should cut the whole thing off and go his own way. But who knows? Maybe effectively that's the way that he's living. I, I mean, I can't tell because, again, he ruined his whole career, um, you know, going on stage and smacking Chris Rock in defense of his wife right which again is just it, it blows my mind again maybe he's clapping cheeks on the side i'm pretty sure he is i mean he's worth millions and millions and millions of dollars he's a world famous celebrity so i'm sure he's clapping some cheeks but still even then even then why continue to allow this woman to traffic and humiliate you in public like this i don't get it maybe he's afraid to lose money uh by divorcing her okay uh maybe that could be the case I'm not entirely sure what's going on here. All I know is that this man is the definition of a simp. He's the definition of a lost man. And again, this is a warning, right? This, this really is a warning uh, not to deal with these, these types of women, okay? Especially women who settle, right? When they settle for you, okay? If you weren't her first pick, okay? If she was obviously in love with somebody else, so she obviously still has some connection to some other man, and you're not her main priority. And again, she clearly is showing that she doesn't appreciate you and what you do because she didn't appreciate what this man was doing for her, whether it came to her birthday, whether it came to, you know, wanting to have the best wedding for her or all the things he's done for her, like slapping uh, Chris Rock in the face, right? She don't appreciate any of it. She don't give a damn about any of it. You have to walk away, right? And I'm not a fan of divorce, but again, at some point, right? At some point, you gotta you walk away, this. okay? You gotta stop the humiliation save some of the dignity okay if will smith even has any left i'm not sure if he does but damn just a, a drop right a drop of just self-worth and, and dignity is worth preserving right i'm just saying if, if i'm will smith okay you're still worth millions you still can probably get any woman or have any woman in the world that you want divorce the woman leave the woman live your life <laughs> happily as a single man maybe find another relationship i'm just saying I don't know what's wrong with this guy. Let me know what you guys think. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Most importantly, share a black conservative perspective. Peace. Wow. I don't even know what to even say regarding this because one for sure is I still don't get it how people will conveniently bring their private life, their family life, and everything that goes on in their home to the public, to social media all of these things are details that we actually do not really need to know F fun fact is nobody cares whatever happens they're just gonna make news on the headline and everybody's gonna enjoy it and have a good time but the fact is nobody cares more so we don't know the basis of what they are dealing with in the family or what goes on in the back end and everything and if you'd ask me it still don't make sense for people to bring their dirty linen, their family private lives in on social media. It's crazy. I mean, these are freaking celebrities. They are Hollywood stars or Hollywood celebrities. And lots of people also look up to them. And I don't get it. Probably they have a different reason why they decided to make it public to announce that they were, they've been separated unofficially for almost seven years now. So many things, so many narratives that would come to play to these things. And honestly, it's crazy. It's honestly crazy. But yeah, let me know what your thoughts are in the comment down below. What are your thoughts about Will Smith and Jada Smith on this one? I mean, everybody feels differently regarding subject matters or topics like this. And I really love your honest contribution on this. You can share all the useful information you think might be really helpful. And until next time, see you in the next video.